Begin with COVID-19 tightening its grip on Oklahoma hospitals. More people are seriously sick. In just the past day, an additional 102 Oklahomans have been admitted to the hospitals. That pushes the current number of patients over 800. At the same time, the state reports nearly 950 new infections over the past 24 hours. And now, an Oklahoma nurse has a plea. She was initially skeptical of the vaccine. But as News 4's Bria Berry reports, this nurse now urges Oklahomans who haven't yet gotten a shot to do so. Bria. Well, that's right, Heather. And Grace Ziba says she's not ready for COVID-19 to give her the fight of her life. And that's why she says it's time to take a stance. I'm not a big anti-vaxxer. I, I am vaccinated um, in every other area. Uh, but this was something that I just wasn't really comfortable with. Integris Grove nurse Grace Zeba says at first she was against getting the COVID-19 vaccine. She says she was skeptical because the vaccine was not FDA approved and there wasn't any real data on how it was going to affect people. These things are, are frightening to me as a nurse um, and I really was not comfortable getting the vaccination. I just kept thinking to myself, I'm young and I'm healthy. And that was kind of my, my stance. But that has changed. Ziva says after seeing healthy young people in the intensive care unit fighting for their lives, she knew she had a part to play. There's a young man in particular that um, recently was, was ill. He is very well known in this community. Everybody loves him. He has a young family. He's younger than I am. He's in his 30s. Ziva says she's now making the decision to get vaccinated. She's now realizing she is not excluded from contracting the virus. I'm not immune as a 40 year old woman with no comorbidities. I'm not immune to COVID and I'm not ready for it to to give me the fight of my life. Ziva says it's better late than never, especially with a new variant on the horizon. Just as we are trying to deal with Delta, we are now um, seeing a gamma variant start to emerge. Health officials say the gamma variant is in Oklahoma and 19 cases have been reported. They say it is more infectious and easier to spread than a Delta variant. Ziva says it's time now to take a stance and save someone else's life. There are hundreds of people around me every day that have been vaccinated and they're stronger because of it. Our health officials say it's too early to determine if there will be a gamma variant surge, but they say there's more to come as we go forward in the next two to six weeks.